Next, Policy Brief, a presentation of the policies of the United States government. The United States supported Burma when more than four years ago, the Southeast Asian nation embarked on a path toward democracy after nearly five years of military rule. We believe in this nation. We see a future where democratic institutions can be accountable and responsive, where political uh, activists are free, where elections are fair, where journalists can pursue the truth, where ethnic minorities can live without fear. Since the largely civilian government took the reins in the spring of 2011, important changes have been made, said U.S. President Obama during his recent trip to Burma. The economy has begun to grow. Political prisoners have been set free. Uh, there are more newspapers and media outlets. Children have been released from the military. And these are all important changes that have opened up greater opportunity for the people of Burma. But for many, progress has not come fast enough or spread far enough, said President Obama. People need to feel safe in their homes and not be subject to arbitrary harassment by authorities or individuals acting with impunity. And as Burma approaches important national elections next year, it will be important to ensure that all of Burma's people can participate in shaping the future of their country. Any legitimate government has to be based on rule of law and a recognition that all people are equal under the law. Two years ago, President Obama pledged that if Burma continued to progress toward democracy, the United States would help ensure Burma's success. We've made good on that pledge, said President Obama, and we reiterate the commitment to match continued reforms with greater support and friendships in the future. That was Policy Brief, a presentation of the policies of the United States government.